came in a kit like this. It was like $36. I got this uh, when I was in Gulfport with my friend. Um, it comes with the brow gel, the brush, which I really, really like. Let's see. And I am in dark brown. So it also has the powder, which I love. I, I really, really like this. I have it on. Um, I and all, I, I really do like this. Also, it's the first time I've ever used a brow gel. So it, it doesn't make it crunchy or anything. So that, that's, that's a plus. All right, next is my beauty, fake beauty blender. I got this, um, the, those little towers where they're like, oh, by me. So I thought I would give it a whirl because I never used a big beauty blender or anything like that. Sorry, mine is dirty. I do need to order that, um, the solid stuff. Um, I actually might try out the actual beauty, why can I not talk, beauty blender, um, sponge. So that's mine. Do you like it? Moving on, um, I also recently just purchased this NYX. This is, uh, in a pink rose. I did some swatches for y'all prior to this. So this is what it looks like right here. Very pretty, uh, pink color. I can't wait to wear this, so I'm excited. Next is my NYX Super Skinny Eye, make, eye Marker. Eye maker. <laughs> marker, which I really, really like it. It's a super duper uh, small pen, and it, I feel like I can get in there and do what I need to do, and I have more control over it. Absolutely like this. Next is my Illegal Length Mascara from Maybelline. I have bought this so many times. Um, ever since it came out, I've been repurchasing and repurchasing and repurchasing. This is my number one mascara. I also really like um, the Ultimate Mascara from Mary Kay too. That mascara is amazing as well. Next, I also another repurchase of a repurchase of a repurchase. I absolutely love this when they came out. It's the Age Rewinder uh, Dark Erase Dark Circles from Maybelline. Um, as you can tell, I've already used it. Um, I think this is like it's my second or third bottle. I'm not sure. Absolutely love this. I do have a little bit of dark circles um, due to because I have Cherokee Indian in me. Yes, just a little bit. But enough to say, oh, it looks like somebody punched you in your face. So this helps out really, really good with me. My next thing is, I also um, got this. Um, I did have the MAC um, concealer one. I forgot. Let me see if I can find it. I might still have it, actually. Yes, I do. It needs to be probably thrown out. <laughs> um, I'm in... NW20, so I was like, I'm gonna give this a whirl. And you could tell, well, they almost the same color, but this one is a little bit dark on me, so um, I got the color in cream, but it's gonna work in the summertime and everything. And like today was in the 80s, and tomorrow is supposed to be 84. <laughs> so uh, slowly but surely, our summer is coming here in Florida. So not wait I'm ready for beach weather I'm ready to go into the water um, but anyways so I'm gonna give this a whirl and see how this goes also some few things I got from today those are like maybe a week or two ago um, let's see what else. I also got the Smashbox photo finish primer uh, at first when I opened it up and everything and I squared a little bit on my hand, I was like, what? That looks kind of oily. And so I was like, wait a minute, let me just shake, shake it up. So I had to shake mine up. I don't know if it's because it's been sitting there for a while because again, it was in those, those Ulta towers that says by me. So I really wanted to try it before I divulge into the bigger one. Um, so far I really do like it. Um... I've only had it a couple times on so far, so we'll see. Also, I got 
was the NYX Micro uh, Pencil. I had the color taupe and it's like, let's see, it comes like this, has, this is the pencil, the other side is the mechan the mechanical, this is the mechanical and this is the spoolie. <laughs> Anyways, um, so I got the color and tip and kind of reminds me of Fling from, um, or is it, is it Fling or Fringe? I can't remember. Um, from a Mac and this is like pretty much half the price of Mac. So it is. So I'm going to try to give that a whirl. I mean, I, I do really like the Anastasia brow thing. It, that's more of I'm going to sit down and get myself ready. This is more I'm going to go run out the door right now. Flip, 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 done. <laughs> Moving on. I broke down and got me the Too Faced Melted. This is in Melting Frosting. It's really beautiful pink. Oh my gosh. I was so impressed while swatching a lot of them in the store. And the packaging, it just feels feels elegant. I don't know what it is on that packaging, but it feels very, very nice. I was like, I don't want to throw that away, but it's a box. <coughs> Excuse me. But it comes like this. It's so pretty. And I did already swatch it earlier. And this is the color. And it would be really pretty. So I'm going to put um, that pink rose underneath and then put this on top and see how that works. Because like I said, summer is upon us. <laughs> Here in Florida. The next thing is hair products. I got three hair products. Um, I have the Nixus Pro Mint. Um, it's supposed to split in binding. After you wash your hair, when it's still damp, you just take your hands and you um, take some and you just rub it in. Um, it's supposed to, it says 92% saw, let's see where did it, yeah, 92% of split and it's back together before styling. So uh, I got some, I have some split ends that need some repair. I mean, I should go get my hair trimmed, but it's like, you know, I'm gonna give this a whirl and see how this goes. So, so far, so good. <laughs> Next is I've never had a hair mask before. So this should be interesting and everything. So far I've used it twice. It is the Shea Moisture Anti-Breaking Strengthening Mask with bay bulb oil and some natural cilantro extract and it comes it's a cream it's a thick cream as you can tell i've already used it um it's twice it smells really good too as well um and you do this i don't put in conditioner when i do this because that would make it pointless in a way to me but um I'll shampoo my hair and I'll put this in there and I'll leave it in for five minutes while I'm doing everything else and I rinse it out. And let me tell you, so far, wow, um, there, the first time I ever used it, my hair was really frizzy. So I was like, I'm going to try it out. So I went in the shower, did this and everything, came out, combed my hair, was a breeze combing. And I normally let my hair dry anyways. Um, I don't use a blow dryer, so I was just waiting for it to dry. But it did not make my hair frizzy at all. It was nice and smooth. It looked healthy. It looked shiny. I was like, where have you been all my life? <laughs> so, I mean, I've only used it twice. So we'll, we'll, we'll see what this, how it's like later on in a month or two. I'll do a review, um, like that when it's almost empty. The next hair product is this. It is not your mother <laughs> way to grow. <laughs> Um, it's a leave-in conditioner spray. It's another thing that says buy me at the Ulta checkout line. So I never done a leave-in conditioner, so I'm really excited about trying this out. Um, if you've ever tried any of these things out, let me know. Um, I'm all about getting my hair nice and pretty. I just recently, if you could tell, um, dyed it to a darker color. It's a um, it's a plum brown color, but I thought it might be a little bit more purpley on the purpley side. But no, I kind of turned, well, I mean, there is purple flecks in it, let's just say that. But I do really like the color. So, 
Um, that's why I'm like, oh, into these. But let me know what y'all think about this stuff. Also, I went to Walgreens and I got three things from there. I normally don't shop at like CVS, Walgreens, or anything like that. I'm more of an Ulta or Sephora girl or a um, go online type deal. But everybody was talking about these Milani blushes. I've never tried a Milani product before. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to give it a whirl. So here they are. Dun, dun, dun. I have Coral Cove and T Rose. They are beautiful. Let me tell you, if you don't have these in your life, you need to have them in your life. I mean, you cannot go wrong with that. Mm -mm -mm. This right here, if you can see that, that's Coral Cove. That's going to be gorgeous during the summertime, maybe spring even. And then, this is the, the tea rose, that one. I love the embossing on it. It's just so elegant and so pretty. And that one's right here, which that can be any day, every day color. Um, these were like seven, seven forty nine, seven forty nine at Walgreens. Can't beat that price. Also, while I was there, I saw that Fergie had a little bit of a line um, with what mild, and I was like, really okay. <laughs> but this spoke to me. This is a um, reflect shimmer palette, or however you want to say. You know a highlighter shimmer shimmer all over your face I don't know what you want to call it but it is really really pretty so that's what it looks like yes. and I did swatch it it's right here if you can see it nice and shimmery but yes so I would try this it was only $5.99 can't go wrong why not and it's so pretty it really is well well, there you go, guys. That's what I've been hoarding for a week or two and things that I just got from today. So thanks again for watching this haul video. I do appreciate it. If you really like this type of video, give me a thumbs up or leave a comment in the comment section. And I'd really like to hear from y'all. Also, um, I, if you like this eye color, I can do a tutorial as well. But next tutorials well oh my gosh I gotta edit this part <laughs> um so thanks again for watching and until the next video bye